And bounce that one in. Let's see if we can kind of squeeze the final. Okay, I, I, I broke it. I, <laughs> it's a balloon. How's it going guys? Dre here and today we're gonna be smashing up some more cars in BeamNG Drive. Now this one is actually pretty special because we got a new campaign to check out. It's not very often we get new campaigns because they are so complex. But this one's called Car Games and it's basically five different mini games for us to play with with different cars. Now these mini games include car darts, car curling, Q games, whatever that means, targets, and airborne. And this is said to be one of the better mods out there. Uh, there's actually a lot of information here, so we'll quickly go through this. There are six different power-ups in the game, so you can actually see them on the backboard there. If we land on those, or if we go through those, we get some sort of event that happens that will help us out in that mini game. So you can see the multipliers there. Uh, you can it looks like you can get up to two power-ups to combine together. Together. Uh, some of them are pretty cool, like the Juggernaut spawns a truck that you can use to move things out of the way. Uh, there's time-based power-ups to lower your time, things like that. And yeah, that's pretty much what it's talking about with the power-ups. Now, there's medals as well for each different game mode. Bronze, Silver, Gold, Platinum, and Diamond. Obviously, you want to try and get that Diamond. All medals in progress are stored in your file, yada, yada, yada. Apologize for not being short, that's totally fine. So basically, we have to get the best medals possible and see how we can do. Now, that was just a tutorial explaining the game, so that really wasn't one of the levels, but we did get... Uh, that one looks golden. I have no idea if that's actually golden, though. Let's move on to the next one and actually get into the car games. So we're starting off with car darts. Welcome to the forest. It's time to make a name for yourself. Don't worry. This event is nice and simple to start you off with. Each theme will get more and more complicated slash challenging. Medals also scale with difficulty, so getting a diamond medal in this event is far easier than getting a diamond medal in the final event. Alright, good to know. So we have to jump off using any of the far ramps, obviously, and there's probably a target down below. The ma a maximum of 100 points can be awarded during the impact on the final position. So bronze is 100, and then developer best is 200. So that's a little confusing. A maximum of 100 points can be awarding during the impact and, oh, and the final position. So first of all, you got to deal with the impact, and then you'll obviously slide a bit, and then it will add the final score as well. So now that makes sense. Uh, hopefully we can get right in the bullseye and not move at all. I don't think I'm going to go right for the middle one. I want to go for these two side ones and kind of turn it in a little bit. But again, I have no idea where the dartboard is. All right, that's good, that's good. This actually doesn't feel too... Ooh, actually, we're going pretty far here. Wait, wait, wait for it, wait for it. Oh, that was almost a bullseye. That was a good first hit, though. And we went into yellow. I don't know how much yellow's worth, but it's right in the middle. So let's see. Well done. Your score is 169. You achieved a gold medal. Okay, I want to retry once more because I do want to go right for the middle and see if that's going to help us out at all. Definitely don't want to do the side ones. That's going to loft you way too high in the air. So I feel like, you know what, we might actually want to slow down a bit because we went pretty far. And, oh, I think I slowed down too much. It's hard to tell, though. We are very, very high up. Actually, oh, oh, stay there. Okay, I don't know if this is 190, 196. I just got a diamond and I almost beat the developer's best score. So that feels pretty good. Let's move on now to the next one. All right, the next one is car curling, the great Canadian pastime. Uh, moving on to somewhere colder, oddly fitting. Steer your car into the scoreboard and score as many points as possible. All orange cars con contribute to your overall score. Any red pigeon score is deducted. All right, so we know how to play curling. You want to get as close to the middle without hitting your own pieces. Now, my question is, is this slippery? Whoa, what's going on behind here? Uh, I was looking for the power-ups because I was wondering if we could use the big truck here. Doesn't seem like that's the case. So we're just gonna... Oh, man, this is actually really slidey. Uh, I'm gonna go try and hit that red pigeon and see if I can slam my other guy. 
kind of into it. No, I think I just let the pigeon win, basically. Let's stop, stop, stop. Get away, pigeon. Oh, man. I love that it's in slow motion. If we can get the pigeon out of the green, did we not get it out? Uh, I scored 276. I actually got a diamond there. I felt like that one wasn't that good. Let's retry once more. I want to see if I can get the pigeon out of it. All right. This one's got some weird noises, too. There's no engine noises, and I love that it slows down automatically. Oh, my God. It's so much more slippery here. All right. There we go. We got to hit the pigeon from the front. Push it as far away as possible. Get it out of the green square. That one should be quite a bit better. How are we doing here? We are still sliding. Brakes, brakes, brakes. I don't think I can use my brakes, so it just kind of goes on its own. And we scored 203, so we did a little bit better. Uh, and we got the diamond once again. All right, what's this one? Q Games having a ball. Okay, so drive into the formation of balls and pot as many as you can. We are playing pool right now, ladies and gentlemen. You have 90 seconds to pot as many balls as you can. If you pot yourself in a pocket, you will be considered a foul shot and thus will be disqualified. 100 points awarded for every ball potted. So to get diamond, we need to get eight balls in. All right, I'm gonna go for that right away here. I'm feeling good. Now I'm wondering, I don't even know if I wanna hit it too hard because I'm gonna damage my car. Let's try it though, we gotta hit it from the side a little bit. Oh, these things, oh, I didn't expect them to be so light. Okay, this is not good though because I wasted so much time. All right, let's see if we can go get this one in over here. There we go, that one's probably gonna go in, I'm gonna assume. We're gonna go throw this one in, come on. Oh, they're so light, they're too light. Okay, this one over here is gonna be easy. We got 63 seconds though, so we do got lots of time. Let's not rush around. Yes, let's get this one over here. We got two over here, so make sure they all go in. That one's going in. That one's in. <laughs> this is cool. At this point, I have no idea how I'm doing. I'm just kind of going around hitting balls. I mean, it's my favorite pastime, whacking balls in the holes, guys. It's, it's a great pastime. All right, so we got that one. But there's only, there's only a few left. I actually, I feel, oh, oh, I'm spinning out. Okay, 32 seconds left, and I totally screwed up that, but that's okay. I'm actually gonna just hit these balls and try and spread them out a bit. That way, we can maybe get one in easily. All right, this one's going in. First shot, perfect. Hopefully, please go in there. It's, it's actually pretty slow, but yeah, we did pocket it in. Six seconds left, can we get this one in? Hit it a little bit sideways. Oh, that backspin. Did you see the backspin on the ball? Get in there. No. Oh, man. I had a score of 600. So we needed to get two more in to get the platinum. All right. Threading the needle. This sounds fun. I know exactly what we got to do. A precise jump. Uh, medals are as follows. Uh, dev best is 272. All right. I don't even care about the scoring system. I know how to do this. So let's just go for it and see what happens. Maybe I should have read that, because there's multiple jumps here. I might be regretting this, but thread. All right, not too bad for that one. We threaded the needle. Okay, so we just got to do multiple jumps. Do we have to decide which way we want to go? All right, I'm going to go over, yeah, to this way. And so far, we haven't been doing very well, but I thought these things would actually hit us. All right, this one's going to be good. Full throttle right through the middle. Keep that speed up, and yes, another one right through the middle. All right, now we just got to... Oh, God. Finish it up. Don't spin out because I think we got one final one. Oh, man. I totally spun out. Okay, how much time do I got? Okay, I don't think there's a time limit. So we're just going to have a nice turnaround here and go to the ending. I wonder if time was a thing, though. Okay, I thought there would be one at the ending, but there wasn't. So we did get the diamond, though. A score of 276. What did the uh, developer get? I'm actually curious. He had... We beat the developer. He had 272. Man, I'm, I'm on a roll today. All right, the next one. This is the last event on this current scenario. There's three scenarios, by the way, so we'll probably go on to the next ones to see how much different they are. So we need to gain as much speed as we can and launch your car off the end of the ramp. The further your car goes, the more score you will earn. The distance you travel is based on how much speed you obtain, so try and break as little as possible during the event. Once your car has reached the ground, your score is obtained. All right, so dev best is 619. You know I'm going for that, and... Okay, we do have some avoidance that we need to do, so I'm gonna go kind of this front screen here, and I wanna make it all the way down, full throttle all the way if we can. Oh, oh my god, that's scary. Yeah, dude, this isn't too bad. This is actually a very stable car, so there we go. Keep it at full throttle this whole time. Ooh, a little bit squirrely. I might have slowed down a bit there, but not enough to really affect it. 
And, oh man, we are flying. Now I have no idea how far I need to go, but I'm hoping that was a good run. I didn't hit anything. I didn't slow down. We got the diamond. We did 566. Sorry, we got the platinum. Next medal was diamond at 600. Okay, so I think I gotta stabilize myself a bit better in the air. I wanna try that once more, because this is probably my favorite event. Long jumps are always fun. All right, just a, a stable 300 kilometers an hour. No big deal. And there we go, there we go. We need to keep that trajectory. I, bro I broke right away. And that might help out. I think that black line is the 600 meters. I don't know if I'm gonna get it. It's gonna be... Dude, that was really close. What did I get? 614. So I did get the diamond. Next medal is not applicable. So what did he have again? 619. I almost beat him. All right, I got to try once more since I'm here. All right, broke once again, but I think I broke a little bit too late. Oh, it's so hard to tell, though, because we are so high up. Come on, I just want to get 619. Yeah, this one isn't as good. Unfortunately... <laughs> we just we just pancaked right into that ground. We got 597 that time. So let's go on to the next. I don't know if there's a trophy award or anything like that. Let's find out. And yes, I thought it mentioned a trophy room. So here we are, a full room of your medals and trophies. Trophy requirements are displayed on stands of trophies. So uh a little confusing. Oh, there we go. Master of the jungle. Look at that. So, this is the first scenario. So we got the Master of the Jungle, Complete Theme 1 Forest, Complete Theme 2. So there's different themes. We didn't go into these yet. The Technological Theme, and then there's a Space Theme. I have no idea what these are. That's obviously a secret. Perfectionist, earn a diamond in all of them. And I think my medals are obviously supposed to be over here. No, actually, these are different challenges. So I thought we would get a medal for each one of them. But no, we get one medal for the theme. So yeah, there's my one medal over there, Master of the Jungle. Let's move on to theme two. All right, we've seen this before, but I'm noticing in the distance now, we do have power-ups. So I was wondering where those things were. So in the jungle levels, it's, it's, it's a little basic. So now we're getting into the harder modes. I'm hoping the levels change as well, because if they're the same levels, that's kind of annoying. But I know in space, there's supposed to be, obviously, no gravity or anything, so that should be interesting. Anyways, whoa! There's another times two over there, so if we went really high up, there's another one. Okay, so I, I'm liking the look of this now. Let's see how the first one did. Obviously, we can slow down a bit and get a better score. But we achieved gold. Okay, I'm definitely going to retry that. I saw some closer medals, so let's actually... I don't think we should go for the times two. Let's go for one of these side jumps. Slow down a bit and see if we can get lucky. All right, this one nice and sky high. If we can hit the times two. Oh, oh, missed it, unfortunately. Missed that one. I want to get that times four, though. That's the one I'm aiming for. All right, got to kind of lean this a little bit to the right because this times four is definitely out of the green circle. So I'm wondering if it's even strategically sound. We got it! We got the times four. Let's see how much this is. Times four is really going to be good, though. Last time we got the gold. Let's see if we can uh, do a bit better this time. We achieved gold again. So the problem with that times four is you cannot go for the bullseye then, which is kind of annoying. You know what? I'm going to try one more thing. Oh, man, I hit next. I was going to try one more thing, but I guess we're just going to have to move on now. That was my bad. And what's going on with the screen here? What the heck? All right, there we go. So we got car curling. This time, there is power-up medals once again. So let's just start it up, because we the biggest thing is these medals now. That's going to be the most strategy here. So, man, they are way on the sides. We got a times four. Okay, I want to... Oh, my, that's a far away red car. There's a times eight in the back. Like, how am I supposed to get that without going right off the thing? Mind you, my other cars count as points, so... This might be a good strategy to just try and get all the bo the the bonuses. That way, your other cars get points. Well done. Your score uh, achieved none. Oh, okay. So yes, you do gotta go actually on the uh, board here. So I don't know these medals. They're so tempting, but I feel like they put you out in the middle of nowhere to the point where it's pointless. So maybe let's just 
play this a little bit more safe, go for the times two here, and hit some of these red dudes out of the way. Yes! Well, we're doing it. Okay, slow down. I want I should have hit those boxes. I really... Yeah, there's no way... You're definitely on ice out here. <laughs> All right, we got the times two. Can we bounce off this? Oh, oh, please tell me. Please don't fall off. It is so slippery, but we stayed on. Did I get, I didn't get the pigeon off, unfortunately. I put him right in the middle. We had a score. Wait, again, no medals. I am not good at curling, evidently. So I think what I'm doing wrong is I'm going full throttle. Curling's not always about speed. It's about precision, so. Let's take it nice and slow here and see what we can do. All right, I actually realized I'm not pressing any buttons right now that you can't slow down, unfortunately. You can only go as fast as it wants you to go. So I'm wondering, actually, should I try and bounce off, for example, like this? And maybe we can grab that truck upgrade. Oh, he got the truck upgrade. Mind you, it said Juggernaut got. It's not, it's not, it's not going to let me use it. I did get a much better placement that time though and I pushed the pigeon out of the good area so let's see if that helps oh actually the truck's coming in oh the truck comes in on its own all right well Jesus okay <laughs> it got one of the pigeons out of the way at least that was awesome I couldn't control it though I actually pressed tab to try and control it did not work did we do better that time though I finally got an actual medal. I got a silver medal. Okay, so I didn't know that. If you, even if you push other cars into the medals, you get the points. Good to know. Let's move on to the next one. We're definitely not going to get a perfect medal here, guys. For every red ball potted, you will get 100 points, and potting the black ball gives you 200 points. Okay, so now we know. Did, was, was that like that before? I was just... No, it was all red balls, so we need to find the black ball. And I think we got... No, I, I don't know if we have a different car or not, but is there a black ball in here? Yes, there is. Okay, we need to make sure... Ooh. Okay, tis but a scratch. We need to make sure we get that ball in. Do the yellow balls give to get him anything? Because I'm assuming they do, so we're just gonna throw that in there. There we go. Oh! Okay, they give you a big fat fail! That's what they do. That's why I should probably read the things a little bit better. Oh, okay, so now I actually read it. It's a good thing I did. I need to pot all the red balls, and then I can pot the black ball, just like real pool. And we're basically playing pool now. I I'm red, so I have to get all the red balls in, and none of the yellow balls. It didn't mention the yellow balls, though, so if you don't know pool, that's very confusing. Don't get the yellow ball in. Okay, we're, we're okay. Let's just focus on where... None of my reds moved. Great, that's, uh... I was hoping to spread them a little bit, but... I guess I can't get lucky enough to do that. There we go. We got the first one in, though. Thankfully, they're all close together, so at least I don't need to go around a lot. Can we bank these balls off of each other? Oh, oh, little, oh, man, that really screwed me up. Okay, back up. This thing takes forever to put in reverse. And bounce that one in. Let's see if we can kind of squeeze the final. Okay, I, I, I broke it. I <laughs> It's a balloon! They're balloon balls! Okay, so I don't know if I could even get that one in now, but I'm gonna try after I get this one in. So let's just... Oh! This thing... You need a, you need a big, fat car, like a Jeep or something to do this. That would be way better. Uh, mind you, it makes it much more challenging, and it's not going very well for me. Are you serious? Are you serious, ball? Okay, come on. I only got 10 seconds left. This is gonna be the worst score ever. There we go. We got that one in. I deflated the other ball, so I don't know if that one even counts, so we're just gonna go for this one. Get in there! Quick! All right, we didn't get it. We had a score of 300. I achieved bronze. That's just embarrassing. Let's try once more. All right, we're doing much better this time. I'm using my throttle to my advantage. And, of course, I totally screw up on the final ball where I actually show you guys. But there we go. We got all the red balls in. Now I just need to get the black ball in in 10 seconds. Totally fine. Right in there. All right. That's a perfect game right there. Success. We got the platinum, guys. Oh, pool with cars is not the easiest thing. Now I know that. Okay. Oh, God. Uh, I am not liking the idea of this. We got a drag racing muscle car that needs to do jumps. Just great. I don't think there's anything else that's different, so let's just go for it. We are going to have to feather this throttle because this thing... All right, this thing is a beast, but we can do it. I know we can. Look at that. Perfect. First try. Go, 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 go. Yes, keep going. Oh, no, maybe slow down a bit. 
Okay, that's fine. I, I didn't want to do this one anyways. <laughs> All right, let's give this side one more chance to redeem itself. We got that one fine. It's just these jumps that really... Oh, slow down. Oh, okay, okay. Okay, nice and slow, nice and slow. There we go. This thing's fast enough to get speed up really, really quickly, so we don't need the runway. There we go. There. Oh, 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 oh. Yeah, all right, back up a bit. Rad's damage, but that's the last of my worries. And full throttle. Yes, perfect. Go, go. Oh, okay, 32 seconds, and I achieved a bronze. That's embarrassing. I thought I was doing good there. Yeah, okay, that's feeling pretty good. Rad damage once again. All right, I don't think this is time-based, so I don't really need to rush it, but there we go. Just a little barrel roll at the end. Finally! I'm so happy I got a score of 305, which gives me a silver. Anything better than bronze, I'm happy with at this point. This, this, this cranked it up to 11, man. It wasn't so bad in the first one, but this second one is crazy. All right, airborne nitrous oxide. So scenario-specific changes. Nitrous oxide power-ups are scattered on the track. At the end of the ramp, you'll be given a boost of one second equals one pickup. All right, so let's go look for those NOS power-ups. I think I see one in the left tunnel there. And uh, this is totally different this time. Last time, there was just a few things we need to avoid. This time... Oh, yeah, this is gonna... Oh, okay, I was supposed to avoid that. At least I'm learning where they are now, so let's try that again. All right, it's always easier in first person when you're looking for things, so let's go that way. Oh my lordy, oh lordy, how did I miss that? Oh my god, oh, okay, that is absolutely crazy. How am I not dead yet? I'm spinning down the whole damn ramp. Okay. Well, we turned that thing into a pretty good tin can, so this is very dangerous. We still had so far to go to. I don't know if I'll be able to go full throttle all the way down this. This is just, I didn't expect the amount of things that are down here. But I am gonna try and get the vast majority of these and keep my speed as good as possible. Oh my god, I, I actually went on two wheels there. Okay, I'm gonna miss that one. That's fine, we'll see how good we can do with just these. Yeah, there's just so many, oh my god. Oh, full throttle, there we go, and oh, this is feeling good, I am, it just keeps going, it just keeps going, damn, and we only got a gold, man, so th those NOS power-ups really help, we're just, oh my god, we're just gonna keep going down, oh, quite a few, but I did also miss, oh god, quite a few, actually getting the NOS power-ups, because I feel like that's the most uh, uh, important part. <laughs> we'll just focus at the end of the ramp on speed. Right now, we gotta get as... Uh, uh. I don't feel like we need it. Okay, I got that one. I got really lucky there. Oh my god. This is, this is crazy. There's no way you're gonna be able... Jesus. That's where you're gonna get the distance. You don't really need speed. Try and get as many of these... Oh my god, as possible. Okay, now we gotta actually start focusing on speed. I can't turn. Oh man. Focus on that and see if that helps. Because I feel like the best strategy with this one is to not crash. All right, I'm giving this one more good try. I did miss quite a few of the power ups. So this time, I'm not gonna focus so much on speed. I wanna get as many of the power ups as possible because I feel like that's how you're going to get the distance. So we're just gonna have a nice, oh shit, we're still flying. Even when I'm coasting down, this is scary. All right, there we go. You know what? That's good to me. I'm not gonna go all the way across to get that one. We're gonna focus on speed now, get that final one, and hopefully we get the distance to at least go further. Oh my God, these uh, cameras, sorry guys. But that felt pretty good. How'd we do that time? We got gold. So we couldn't get the platinum, unfortunately. That is not easy, though. We did miss one of the power-ups, so you definitely couldn't prove it, but let's move on. All right, and we are back in the trophy room with our new trophy. So we got one more to do, and that's Space Ace, and I think we're gonna leave that one for the next time, guys. So I hope you guys enjoyed this. If you guys do want to see some more, obviously let me know in the comments below how you like these. Do you like the campaigns? Do you like it when I just do crazy shenanigans as well? Uh, I definitely want to finish up this campaign trying to get as many of these uh, medals as possible because this is really cool. 
A lot of time and effort went into developing this campaign, I can tell you that much. The fact that we have a trophy room alone kind of shows that. So we're going to wrap it up here, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed this one. As always, thanks for watching and liking, guys. And I'll see you in the next one.